What's going on you guys? Welcome back. Another day, another detail, another transformation. We're not gonna be using the, the trailer no more. Just because it's <laughs> we're like water right here. Just because the trailer like it's a hassle to be honest to be putting it on and then taking it off. Yeah, I'm, I'm, lazy. We're I'm lazy. Yeah, it's a little bit lazy, but it's a lot faster just so we can wake up, fill up, and that's it rather than putting the trailer on the truck. It saves a couple minutes, but over here right now it's getting really cold, so I'd rather just have everything on the inside of the truck for now until we get the clothes trailer. But for the inside, we're gonna be this is gonna be wood on the floor. We removed the, the plastics. Okay, so like I was saying this is like bone stock with all the panels, and this side is the one with the panels. We're gonna be removing the panels just because we're gonna be putting those where the bottles go. On, on the side, but we're still trying to figure out left or in the right side. But right now we're gonna have the whole detailing setup in here in the truck, just so it can look a lot better. And we have a couple a couple goals that we want to achieve. So we're gonna be removing this plastic. And ew, the fucking speaker died with. No mamas. Everything's dying up in this. Everything's dying up in this joint, man. Here, let me go ahead and put you guys down so I can remove the plastic. Do a time lapse of us removing this plastic. The bottle or the little frame? The frame thing. Hey, you see my ass crack, yo? Yeah. <laughs> So we couldn't be remove the right side because there's like a bunch of sensors back here. Look, watch out! All this stuff. So it's not like on that side where it's pretty much plain. I don't know what the fuck all this is, but. Are you recording? Yeah, I'm recording. Huh? Yeah, I'm no, recording. Stop the recording hey. and then press the thing that I told you. Hey, Hey, hold on. The magic toolbox. Alright. Let's move this. This is. Dude, take out the whole thing. We're gonna have to redo it. No. Look at this man learning how to use vice scripts. ¿Qué crees que le enseñó? ¿Dónde acá? What? Push, push the tank over here and just go. This has webon. Pues no que le vamos a cambiar. ¿Para qué se lo pones? Well, it's gonna pinch on the wall. Yep. Has to be an L. No, because the other hose was like really long. Look. We compare this to that. Look at that, you dumbass. No, you, you stick them over here. Hold on. That's the. What the fuck is holding it? Ow. Huh? What's holding this shit so tight? Si, va a ser esa pendejada, wey. Quitasela. <laughs> It'll have to be PVC pipe. Alright guys, so we have like a little complication about removing the seats. Well at least this seat actually. We already removed the, the three bolts as one right here, one right there, one right there. But we're struggling to get this one that's right here in the corner. Because the seat doesn't go forward. And it's like we use every single tool to take it out, but there's like no way. It lifts up a little bit. But it's off the thing already. But we've been going at it right there for maybe like 20 or 30 minutes. Well, we gotta get this done and it will be done. Because we gotta get this setup looking right. And making it look good for the for the vlogs when we record our, our detailing video, so. I'll go ahead and pick up the camera once we remove the, the seat. Right 
right guys so now we have uh, look at my airpod is fucking sticking out cricket <laughs> we got this done damn the lighting is ass bro see we had my camera now she has a fucking light didn't know we're building well we built rebuilding our custom detailing setup uh we no longer want to use the trailer this is the the second day from yesterday's recording but today yesterday we just did the line the, like the cutting and everything i to line it up and today we did actual cutting the pressure washer we're going to be putting these max shine uh, racks right here so the products go like that we're going to put that here and right here we're going to put the generator yes, sir. and we're going to be pulling it out Yep. Maybe, I don't think it'll fit. Alright guys, so <clears throat> we got the wood done. We went to Lowe's to get like um, all the fittings and all that once again so it could look nice. Let me go ahead and show you the, the PVC pipe that we have bought. So this is the... Uh, PVC that we bought is a two footer is towards the water tank and then right here a little like a connection where this will go like that connect and this is where I will fill up my gallons products or whatever so that's that's that now let me go ahead and show you guys the the real thing the full custom thing that uh build that we did uh, let me nice and good let me go so we have the generator here, but we're gonna be removing the generator. Um, we were thinking about bringing it over here, like having a, like a dresser kind of thing, but we're gonna have this in the front actually, because it does take a lot of space. And we're gonna be putting another racket right here, as well as two buckets, the, our wash bucket and the rim bucket, like in the rim and tire bucket. So it'll be two buckets here with the pressure washer, so we don't have to worry about burning anything. Um, Right here we have our air freshener, our gloves, our business cards because when customers ask for you, you got to get them right away. And we have our tire applicators right here and the uh, import car care line, you know. Then we got some 3D, the, the compound, the polishing, the one-step polish, the trim care, gum and tire remover. Uh, we have beat it up, um, wheel bright, the, our phone cannon. Our, our carnauba wax and our fiber guard which that ceramic goes to any cloth but that's that's our little custom build um i think it's, this is gonna be it for this video if not i'll go ahead and pick up the camera if we have we had more stuff in the front but if it's the end of this video don't forget to drop a like make sure you subscribe if you haven't already and i'll go ahead and i'll catch you guys on the next one all right, guys, so we did a couple chains on the back so it could look a little more, you know, professional and easier access. So we removed the, the generator and we put the vacuum since we're always using that every single car extension cord. We put it connecting to the generator. We zip tie this. So you just pull this and bang on us. And our, let me move this, our wash mitt and our wheel bucket. So <laughs> so this I can see you bucket too. right here for the wash mitt. I can see you. Yeah? So we hide back here. But that's pretty much how we how we changed it. But we're still we're still trying to figure out from the front. We're not trying to figure out but we're waiting. Look, this is where the generator is at. So when you open the door, boom, easy access. You just put run and pull it and then the water tank look what that's taking care of the jb well or whatever and it's gonna go right here and on the other side we might have like our steamer microfiber towels um yeah still trying to see you guys like the back one looks ugly but from the other side it doesn't look as bad it, huh? yeah we should paint it black bro what? black or like have it stained nah i think black yeah huh? i mean but yeah then we're gonna have to sand it and we're later on we're gonna change the carpet so this this setup is permanent for right now but the inside of details of the truck is temporary because we want to get rid of this carpet 
put wood or um, linoleum. We're gonna change the seats to black seats, clean up the whole inside. But there's a lot of stuff we gotta do to it, but little by little, we're getting there. We're trying to find our system that works best for us. And we just, just so you guys know, we do all the piping, fitting, and all the Mexicanazos ourselves, our Mickey Mouse. We never take it to no professional. I'm a professional. No. Where, where are YouTube where? certified? Nah, but then we just gotta cut these though. I would, but I don't know when I we know. install the seat. Yeah. I think we should just leave them. It doesn't even bother us right now. We gotta get like rubber caps or something. Well, we have the, the screws. Yeah, we left the screws on just so we won't hurt ourselves completely. We could put some JB well in here so they won't go up and down. And they just stay flat like that. And but we're not really gonna go in the back here. Besides we're not. It up. We're not gonna sleep. <laughs> but on the other side, I wanna have a nice setup for our microfiber towels. But that's later on. And then behind this, the water tank is gonna go right here. So like right here, I wanna have like a rack of our full of gallons and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. But little by little. Should we tra change generator? All right, so Lo Gordo just finished wrapping this what is it the sign this poster or whatever for whenever we do uh, whenever we do details we're gonna be putting that right there like along towards like where traffic is, traffic is coming so they can know what we do and we could attract more attention um he he just did the, the red wrap on the other side is already finished well partial finish we still gotta add a couple more things but from this side is red but let me go ahead and show you guys the other side look at that Sheesh. All vinyl, baby. All vinyl, weatherproof. Save money. Yup. Yeah. Do it like that. Do it for the thumbnail. Boom. Look at that thumbnail. Mmm, daddy chill. Mmm, daddy spank me or shank me. Mm. But yeah, that's um, vinyl. Pretty much what they use to pretty much car wrap. And then we use some Oracle 651 uh, decal stickers. So those are waterproof. Um, UV protector so it will not get faded uh, this is gonna take a pretty much a long time to get messed up we're gonna be adding like our social media right here and what like other services and our scanning code just so customers won't be bothering us but if they for now it's gonna be like that so when they come up to us we'll give them a business card but this is how the whole setup turned out to be me and Lo Gordo did this on our own we didn't no, pay sure. nobody but if you did like this video don't forget to drop a like subscribe and yeah, we'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace out. Oh, I matched this shit. <laughs>